The Redeemed Christian Church of God organized its 2020 Inspiration Conference themed Galvanizing for Growth, which brought together industry leaders. On the sidelines of the event, the Vice President of Nigeria, Professor Yemi Oshibajo, and the President of the African Development Bank, Akiumi Adeshino, spoke extensively on the need to focus on outcome-based financing, need for accountability, as well as efficiency in the use of finances to bring about results. At the cost of infrastructure, not just in Nigeria, but um, in, in, in Africa globally, you have that roughly about, uh, you know, almost 40% uh, of infrastructure is financed by governments, right? And, and so if you have 40% being financed by governments, the efficiency of that expenditure is particularly important. So it doesn't just mean that we need more money for infrastructure. Yes, we have an infrastructure financing gap in Africa, which is about $68 billion to $108 billion a year. But if government is financing a lot of infrastructure, let's make sure that it is good infrastructure, quality infrastructure, that the procurement system is such that you're getting the best people to do it. And let's also make sure that it's not the input that matters, it's the, it's the output. And there must be an accountability system that basically says we're putting one dollar or one naira into this and it's actually producing the visible results. And I think citizen um, forum for accountability are always very important to be sure that government resources are being used very well. Everyone to keep a focus on what is important. Both the lender and the borrower have a focus on what is important. So there is, in some senses, a partnership to achieve the objectives. And that is very, that's very crucial so that the, the, the lender in particular doesn't feel that they have succeeded just by merely giving a loan and expecting a return. They succeed when the outcome is right and when the outcome is profitable. And that's all on Business News at this hour. I am Irene Ubani. Still ahead on Plus TV African News is our roundup on entertainment and sports. We'll be back in a moment.